Hi guys, I have a little problem with my face here and it's been a little busy, so it's been a while. I'm sorry about that. Um, I know it's been hot and Stanley, I know you like ice cream and probably Julian does too. So I found a book that's about hot weather and ice cream called Simply Delicious. So let's take a look at what is Simply Delicious. There we go. Let's see. This is kind of a longer story here, so I've got to get kind of close. One evening, as he rode home on his faithful bike, Mr. Minky stopped at Muffin's Corner Shop and bought a double-dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow sprinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles for his little boy, Finnegan. Now, how will I get this double-dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream home before it melts, he wondered. I know. I'll take a shortcut down the bumpy, lumpy jungle track. It runs right into my back garden. Mr. Minky bound... Let's get this right here. Mr. Minky bounded on his bike and shot off along the jungle track. Giant bamboos arched over his head. Leaves as large as dinner plates brushed against his busy bicycling knees. Mr. Minky lifted the ice cream high into the air to keep it safe and wave it around to keep it cool. Two butterflies, sipping honey from a rare orchid, saw the ice cream lumping and bumping along below them. I like the look of that double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, one butterfly said to the other. Simply delicious, the other replied. Off they fluttered at bicycle speed, hovering over the ice cream, trying to land on it. Mr. Minky began swinging the double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream in circles, hoping to baffle the butterflies while keeping the ice cream cool. A toucan perched on a swaying bamboo saw the ice cream bumping along the track below. There's the toucan. See? Hmm. I love the look of that cho double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, tweeted the toucan. Simply delicious. And it dived and darted at the ice cream. Mr. Minka, biking hard, swept his left hand down and held the double-dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream at knee level, waving it in circles to baffle the butterflies, taunt the toucan, and keep the ice cream cool. The butterflies fluttered, the toucan dived, and Mr. Minky bounced up and down, up and down as he biked along the lumpy, bumpy jungle track. A spider monkey, peering out from under the creepers, saw the ice cream lumping and bumping by, only inches from his nose. I love the look of that double-dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, said the spider monkey. Simply delicious! And down it swooped on the ice cream. Mr. Minky whipped the ice cream up once more, holding it straight out in front of him. Then he waved it up and down to baffle the butterflies, taunt the toucan, muddle the monkey, and keep the ice cream cool. The butterflies fluttered, the toucan dived, the monkey swooped, and Mr. Minky bounced up and down, up and down as he biked along the lumpy, bumpy jungle track. A ferocious tiger glowering in, the, in its lair saw the ice cream speeding by. I like the look of that double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, snarled the tiger. Simply delicious. And it sprang at the ice cream. Mr. Minky's going to be a very busy man. Look at that. All those animals there. But, let's go over here. Mr. Minky quickly tossed it from his left hand to his right, catching it in midair. 
Holding it at arm's length, he swung it from side to side, hoping to baffle the butterflies, taunt the toucan, muddle the monkey, trick the tiger, and keep the ice cream cool. The butterflies fluttered, the toucan dived, the spider monkey swooped, the tiger sprang, and Mr. Minky bounced up and down, up and down as he biked along the lumpy, bumpy jungle track. A huge crocodile was sunning itself on the riverbank. In between the leaves as large as dinner plates, it saw the ice cream sweeping by. I love the look of that double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, croaked the crocodile. Simply delicious. And it lunged at the ice cream. Mr. Minky has quite a few people following him, huh? But Mr. Minky tossed the ice cream high into the air. As it came down, he cleverly caught it on his toe, kicked it up into the air again, caught it with his elbow, flicked it high, tilted his head back, and then caught it once more, this time on his nose. The butterflies fluttered, the toucan dived, the spider monkey swooped, the tiger sprang, the crocodile lunged, and Mr. Minky kicked right and left, keep, keeping them at bay, bouncing up and down, up and down, while balancing the ice cream on his nose as he bump, biked along the lumpy, bumpy jungle track. At long last, he burst out of the jungle, shot up his homemade ramp, and flying through the air across the back fence, glided gracefully into his own back garden. Little Finnegan ran to meet him. Mr. Minky tossed his head, caught the ice cream as it flew through the air, and held it out to Finnegan. Seeing the double dip chocolate chip and cherry ice cream with rainbow twinkles and chopped nut sprinkles, Finnegan shouted with happiness. He swept his tongue across it in grand style. Simply delicious, he yelled. I feel quite hungry myself, said Mr. Minky, smiling at Finnegan's joy. Hungry? The crocodile looked at the tiger and licked his lips. The tiger looked at the spider monkey and licked his lips. The spider monkey looked at the toucan and licked his lips. The toucan looked at the butterflies and clicked his beak. They all want to eat each other, don't they? Simply delicious, they cried, and began chasing one another back through the jungle along the lumpy bumpy track. Mr. Minky put his bike in the shed and went to dinner. Spicy pie and scrumptious pudding. Look at all of those animals chasing each other. <laughs> Simply delicious. And that's Mr. Minky's dinner. Looks pretty good, huh? And that's it. Okay, guys. I hope you enjoyed Mr. Minky and his ice cream. And hopefully you'll get an ice cream sometime soon, too, to cool you off. But I don't think your dad is going to have to do all the stuff Mr. Minky did. Anyway, you have a good time. And uh, we'll talk to you again soon, I hope.